Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of Why You Need This and today um, I'm going on holiday to Swanage and we needed a roof rack and I looked around and it was going to cost four or five hundred quid for a roof rack and we got nowhere to store it. So my wife said, why don't you look at roof bags? Ordered this, Sail Novo and I haven't used it yet so if it's rubbish I won't upload this video. If it's really good, which I think it might be, then this is going to be a new episode of why you need this. Let's see how it gets on. Love, peace, unity. Update on the roof rack. Absolutely brilliant. I didn't think it would be as good as I thought it would. Um, so it was a lot easier to put up than I thought. You just put it on the roof load it up, close it. Um, there was a lot of excess um, strap that you just have to like, I used it to make it even more secure, sort of uh, wrapped it round more and looped it into the handles of the, um, of the bag. And I kept forgetting it was on the roof. So it had a really good testing. What I mean by that is I'd go up to a roundabout and break like I didn't have you know, 80 kilograms on the roof, which I did. I had a, a large suitcase, a small suitcase, a child's buggy, bits and bobs, extra little bags. It was uh, jam-packed to the rafters. And you can see that in the video. And um, I, I kept forgetting, uh, breaklastminute.com, um, got up to the roundabout, um, and it, there was no signs of tear, where uh, we got a bit of rain, everything was dry inside. On the way back, even quicker, I, I knew how to pack it then. So I just, <laughs> probably like 20 minutes, full, full and packed. So, <clears throat> and packing it into the bag for storage to put it in the loft, it actually fit in. It wasn't even that hard to pack. Probably about three minutes to pack. And, it's st and you saw the little bag, tiny. So I think car roof racks are a thing of the past, waste of money. Unless you've got a lot of space. Um, so, fully recommend. And have a nice day. Get ready for the next one. 